Hello everyone. Let's study bar graph part 1. Read the following graph carefully and answer the question given below. A company manufactures 7 different products A to G. The following graph shows the breakup of cost price, profit and discount for each of this product. Now let's see the first question. The percentage discount is maximum for which of the given product. Now before actually solving this, let us just revise what is selling price, what is mark price and what is cost price. So my selling price is nothing but as my cost price plus profit which means it is blue color bar plus the red color bar. And my mark price is nothing but as selling price plus discount which means it is blue color plus red color plus the white color bar. Clear? What we want to find out? discount percentage and it is given as discount calculated upon mark price into 100. Now, instead of using the values given on the left hand side, what we can use is consider this length of bar will be proportionate to its value. You can solve this question by substituting the value but for that we need to calculate discount percent for all the seven product and it would be time consuming. Let's see this method and see how can we save the time. So, the discount is nothing but as white bar and mark price nothing but as white plus red plus blue colored bar. What we want? Discount percent to be maximum. If discount percent is maximum, then what I would be doing is, I'll assume my white color bar for each of this product as one and I'll try to identify how many times does the white color bar goes in the entire bar. Because if my numerators are 1, then minimum number of time if it goes, 